Hey guys, I got you on the old phone right now because uh, my new phone's charging, so I pulled out the old one just to record with it real fast while it's charging. But today is Sunday, December 15th. <laughs> uh, it's really weird. It doesn't feel like a Sunday at all because Devin actually just left for work. He was off Friday and Saturday and he had to go in today. And he's going to be working today all the way through the Sunday before Christmas. It's eight days in a row. Whenever that is. Nine days in a row? Whatever. <laughs> He's going to be working all the way up to Christmas break. Um, the reason he was off Friday is because they were doing inventory at his work. So they were doing things that they don't normally do every day. So he, he got to work Thursday, come home Friday, Saturday, and then uh, go in today. But anyways, <laughs> I got a whole bunch of mail that I got Friday and Saturday. I didn't share because um, last two days, and even today, my, my back is hurting really bad. Down low, like... Um, the lumbar I guess area I've done something to it I've pulled something or something and it just really hurts to bend and to really hurts to stand back up <laughs> I can't lift anything super heavy including Jesse I can pick him up only if he's already at a higher level like if he's standing on the couch or something I can pick him up but I cannot bend down to pick him up uh, I don't know I'm hoping it goes away without me having to go to the doctor but uh, I don't know what I did but it's hurting <laughs> but um so I want to show you all the smell that I got, and I also want to show you, I did to do two clips of me opening the uh, 12 Days of Christmas yesterday and today for Marianne. I actually have them right here. I have clips that you'll, you would have seen or you will see, I don't know. But this was uh, day 14, which was yesterday, and it's really pretty crystally buttons. I gotta find something that, that we use these, because they're really pretty and sparkly. <laughs> or not sparkly, but shiny whatever <laughs> and then today's was this cute little lotions pouch it says alpaca it's just a cute little bag that i can use to put stitch markers or something like that in super cute so i'm excited about that i'm excited to open those each day next year i'm going to get my sister to build me an advent calendar that's uh the whole 25 days long I'm, i'll probably just um save up some money and then give it to her and let her go buy me random yarns or patterns or hooks or you know whatever <laughs> and have her give them to me well you know they'll be at home and i open them and it'll just be fun i technically would have paid for it <laughs> all but um it is to be surprises that's what i'm trying to say but yeah so i got a bunch of mail and i can't remember exactly which day they each came on because it's just the last two days <laughs> my back hurting i put all the cards in my mickey bag so i'm gonna get them all out carefully to you. Oh, is, oh yeah. <laughs> I saw something down in there and I was like, what is that? But they're not very really Once I see that. Okay. Alright, these are in no particular order because like I said, I can't remember which days they came on. This really pretty Christmas tree. Really pretty. It's from Rosalind. Ah, I'm dropping it. <laughs> oh, I can't open it. Rosalind from Australia. And she sent me two ornaments. I already put tags on these so you guys can see um, the way I do it. Really pretty wreath. And I put these, someone gifted me these homemade tags. And I've been using them. I write who they're from, the year, and where, who it's from, where they're from, and the year on there. And then she also sent me this ornament. Make sure I got it facing the right way. I also put a tag on it. It's really pretty. I'm so excited about all these homemade ornaments because in the future, like I said the other day, when I have a tree just dedicated to homemade ornaments, it's just going to be covered with ornaments from all over the world. And it's so cool to think that. I got this really funny card. It's so funny. Me and Debbie both thought this was hilarious. It's from Kim from Tennessee. She lives fairly close to me. Um, not like next door neighbors, but like fairly close. I know where she's from. I've been through there plenty of times. But she sent me this funny card. <laughs> It's this funny cat drinking some eggnog, and there's a granny square blanket in the background. And in the back of it, it's got the eggnog. But it's so funny. Thank you so much, Kim, for that. And to her, um, her Facebook yarning name is Crochet by Kim Munsey. I think that's how you spell her, uh, say her last name. But it's M-U-N-S-E-Y. But me and Devin both got a kick out of this card. It's so cute. Her whole, she's got her whole family's name on here. But I'm pretty sure her name's Erin. <laughs> I already put the envelopes over there. But she's from Ohio, and she signed her her card from her whole entire family. And the last one says Sweet Peas, so I'm assuming that's a pet. But, um, oh yeah, dogs, too. She's from Ohio. Did I already say that? This is really pretty. I like the colors on this card. Really pretty colors. And then I got a card from Kim. 
Kim the Crafty, uh, Crafty Nomad. Um, I'm not actually going to show her card, because I don't know if she's showing her card. I showed Karen's and with her family because she showed her kids before and she's, you know, other people's been sharing her card. But I'm not going to share Kim's because it's got her son on there. And I don't know if she's going to want that all over. But thank you, Kim. I got it. <laughs> and then I got another one from Sonia. Sonia has a channel too. It's uh, Cat Crazy Creations on YouTube. And she lives in California. There's a lot of people that watch me from California. But it is a huge state. So I love this card. Such a pretty scene with all the animals. And Santa's looking at his list. So pretty. And this one's really pretty too. I love all these cards. <laughs> I keep saying about all of them. Sharon from California. I love this. My sister loves the truck with the tree in the back. She's got a lot of decorations of that. And it's glittery. Okay, right, and this next one is from Debbie from Louisiana. I love this picture. It's really pretty. And then I got one from Adele in Texas. And she sent stitch markers. Actually, I've left them in there so that I wouldn't accidentally... Um, misplaced some before I showed you but this is her card that she sent it's really pretty too I don't say about all of them but they are all really pretty and then she also sent stitch markers there's a foot up there a crown and another crown and now that I've showed it I will take those off and use them I just didn't want to accidentally misplace them before I got to share them <laughs> this next one I thought it was a card and it wasn't <laughs> this next one really pretty cardinal card is from Kat from Massachusetts, and she also sent a green tea for me to try. Ah, I'm dropping everything. And then I got one from Kelly in Georgia. This is a really pretty card. It's so cute. It's got these cute little woodland uh, critters on there, and it's got glitter on it. Super pretty card. I love this card. Me and Devin both love this card a lot. I love all of them, but this one really stood out to us. Ah, it, has, it has a note in it. And it's from Linda from North Carolina. This is such a pretty scene. It's just a mountain, but this mountain back here is glittery. That's so pretty. I love mountains. Oh, I put that note back in there. And then I got uh, this one from Susan from Delaware. <laughs> I had to think cute little snowman and this one is really cool the card I've never had a door shaped card before <laughs> and I've seen this one's from uh, CJ I've seen her uh, commenting a lot on my videos since forever but I just thought this was so cool because I never had a door shaped card before <laughs> it's a really pretty red door with a little dog super pretty the envelope has it on there too that's just my address so and it's got the sticker on there <laughs> but she also sent me this snowflake which I haven't made an ornament out of it yet, but I will. Really pretty crochet snowflake. Thank you so much for that. Is that all the cards? Nope, I got one more card. Okay, the last card that I got is from Jeannie. Or, is that Jeannie? Jeannie? But her yarny name is Crafty Grandma Gina. So, she goes by Gina. But she sent, she's from Kansas. She sent first this cute little uh, ornament, which I'm going to put Jesse's picture in <laughs> when I get around to remembering to do that. But again, I wrote on the back of this one who it's from, where they're from, and the year. And uh, so I'm going to put a cute little picture of Jesse in there. And I might let him color it. I don't know. I haven't made it in my mind yet because I like the wood too. But I might let him color it if he wants to. But she sent me the coolest card ever. I've seen these cards at Walmart and stuff. And um, it's one of those pop up cards. <laughs> it's Snoopy and a bunch of wood stocks. And then the back of it. That is so cool. I gotta set this somewhere where I can display it safely without just getting a hold of it. But it's so cool. It's like a it's like a pop-up book, but it's a card. <laughs> oh that's so neat. Okay, and I did also get a couple packages and then I got one from Snappy Tots. Um she's Heidi Yates. She's a pattern designer that I really love. She every year she does a uh, duck event <laughs> and the, uh, sometimes it's for Christmas sometimes it's for like anniversaries of her pattern stuff this year she did a Christmas one and it's elf duck 
and I'm not I can't show you the duck until tomorrow because <laughs> the duck is secret until um, to secret to the public until tomorrow and then I, I can share that after the 16th uh, because it's only for the duck people and what you do is when you, you buy it I think it was six dollars this time and that includes shipping so you get the cute little duck and uh, cute little sand that comes with it I won't show you because it might give it away <laughs> but uh, you also get patterns um, we got, I think, five patterns. Two for, like, humans. There's a hat and something else. I can't remember now. And then we got three patterns for the duck, <laughs> which is cute. Uh, and the whole point of the duck is you're supposed to, like, take it with you other places and, uh, you know, wherever you go and put it, like, in the picture. Take a picture of it, like, if you go to see Christmas lights, you know, put the duck in there. And it's just a fun little community thing. And it's also a way to get some patterns for cheap and uh, help support her as a creator. But I do have the duck. It's right here. I just can't show it to you. And I will show it. I'll try to remember to show it in one of the Vlogmases next week. Um, because I can't show it until Monday the 16th. Alright. And then the packages. Carefully move the packages. Because I don't want to mess it up. One of, the first package that I got is from Leanne. I didn't write where she was from. Yes, I did. Massachusetts. Duh. She says it in her card right here. <laughs> She's in a really cool card. I'm going to cover up her note. Where's the one I cover it up with? It's a different card. <laughs> but the card is really cool, like a fold-out card. <laughs> I just wanted to cover up the note because I like keeping those private. And she sent me, in her note she said that she wanted to give me a little peek of New England. So she sent me a few, I guess, New england -y things. <laughs> so first is this ornament slash um, magnet this little girl she's on the fork <laughs> and I'm probably gonna use that as an ornament that's why I put a tag on it super cute and then she sent me these really pretty tea towels I'm trying to get them I'll never use these as tea towels I'll always use them as decoration for uh, the stove I guess after this Christmas so this one is a really pretty snowman this is joyful <laughs> And they're huge um, little towels. And then this one is reindeer. He's got a cardinal on his head. This is Noel. That's beautiful. And she also sent this book, which is for Jesse, I guess, but it's also for me. <laughs> it's, just, it's cool. But it's uh, I Love New England and ABC Adventure. So it's a New England based book. Like all the alphabets in there are about New England things. Hockey! <laughs> I love hockey. But, um, I mean, Jesse can go through it. And then I did write in the front of the book that it was a gift from a viewer. And I put her name and where she's from in the year so that we can always remember where we got it and when. So that's a really cool uh, gift. That's cool for me and Jesse. All right, and I got uh, the last package I got. This I did get yesterday. I think I remember that. Whew, I'm tired. <laughs> My back's hurting, so it's hard to maneuver. Okay, the last one, I love this card because it's a patriotic Christmas card. But it's from Wendy from, I think, Wisconsin. Wendy from Wisconsin. <laughs> really pretty uh, patriotic card. Uh, Christmas card. She sent me some ornaments. She sent me three ornaments. This one is a Rudolph head. I'm not even going to lie. When I first opened it, I thought it was a chicken butt. <laughs> It looks like one of those chicken butt coasters. But it's a Rudolph head. Ah, I'm pulling the thing off of it. I have to put that light label back on that. I pulled it off. And she also sent me one of the little, um, boggins. <laughs> Whatever they're called. Little hat ornaments. I done pulled both of these labels off of it. Both of these ornaments. And then, she, lastly, she sent me a little star. She also sent me, um, a note which is private <laughs> I'm going to put that over here because she actually she asked me to make her something but she sent me this cool little um, crochet home magazine I have another one of these that I ordered off of eBay she gave me this one because she liked this watermelon set but there's also a lot of other cute patterns in here the watermelon set is cute but I saw where did it go now these little guys are cute There's a lot of patterns in here. Really cute uh, graphic and a little deer. That'd be a really cute baby. 
uh, blanket for, you know, one of the born. <laughs> and then she also sent me, she sent me money for a bag set. And she also sent me everything I need to make it. <laughs> she sent me the fabric for the, the bag, the notions pouch. She sent me zippers and interfacing for me to make her uh, a project bag set and send it to her. Which I thought was awesome that she just included everything. So I will definitely be doing that. I'm, I'm still cutting some bags. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this out now that I've showed it to you guys. And I'm going to um, cut it to make her bags. I have a big old bag. All right, so I guess I'll make her notions pouch out of these ones and her product bag out of this print and line it with this print. So that's cool. <laughs> I love the way it came like a little kit. I thought that was so cute, a little bag kit. And she sent interfacing for her bag and everything. So that's cool. And zippers. So that's awesome. <laughs> but she also asked me about a amigurumi that she wants to give to her mother. So I'm going to look for a pattern and uh, try to find one for her that I can make for her mom. Yeah, so that's all the mail I got Friday and Saturday. Um, I just didn't feel like <laughs> recording either of those days. Because uh, my back has just been out of commission. <laughs> I'm going to try to record some today, but I don't know how much it'll be. Um, I got some sewing stuff to do. I need to finish cutting material and then I need to start sewing because I'd like to get some bags out this next week and um what else I gotta do I got I got some more crochet things I want to get started on because I need to film a no kitchen name episode but I don't have anything to share so I need to uh make some stuff to share with you guys oh what else I gotta do nothing much today I'm just gonna try to take it easy and not hurt my back any more than it already is hurting but I will catch up with you later or tomorrow I don't know we shall see <laughs>